Oh, hi there. I'm Luella Fern Burton Siler McWilliams, otherwise known as Grandma Lou. Oh, well, I'm supposed to talk about my life. My life has been so wonderful. I just don't know where to begin because I really have had a really great life. I've had two wonderful husbands. I have three wonderful grandchildren and then my extended family. I have, how many grandchildren do I have? I have nine. Oh, I, nine have, that's right. I have nine all together. I have uh, Chad, I have uh, Matthew and Claire and Joel and Josh and Jessica. That's my extended family. And I love them dearly. And uh, we have a lot of fun together when we get together. And um, it's just been, oh, what can I say? Uh, you couldn't ask for anything more. <clears throat> but getting back to my life, uh, if you start in the beginning, uh, I was, uh, well, there was many circumstances that happened in my life. It seemed like different things just fell into place that uh, this little girl was given opportunities that uh, the normal child never had the right to to do these things and they they just never had uh, the opportunity to experience these wonderful things that happened in my life so i was very fortunate my uh, father was killed in a mining accident and in catlin uh, illinois how old were you then i was uh, i was about i think the way it was, he was killed in February. Now, if I had the genealogy here, I could flip and tell you exactly. I, I, he was killed in February, and I would have been four in July. So after the death of uh, my father, my mother went to live with her parents in West Frankfurt, Illinois. Now, this is where my father's parents lived too. So I had both sets of grandparents there. And I went from one grandparents to the other grandparents. And I had many aunts and uncles. I had Aunt Della. I had Aunt Eileen. I had Uncle Bud, Uncle Donald, Uncle Bill, uh, Uncle Leo. Uncle Leo was the last child of my grandmother's. And he was born she was, I think she was 50 when Uncle Leo was born. So Uncle Leo and I weren't that far apart in ages, and we lived in the same home, and I was a, more or less a thorn in his side. I followed him around, and I aggravated him, and I got into thing, and he'd say, leave me alone, that sort of thing. Uh, but anyway, we, we, had a, we had a good relationship.